welcome back to another week in the life. I feel like I have literally been running like 200 miles an hour. It's crazy. I'm currently driving right now to head to a listing appointment. Last Friday was a really good day. We signed a new listing. We actually drove to LA to meet with our client. Great meeting. We're pumped. So excited for our new listing that's gonna hit the market and that was really awesome feels good I'm excited about this listing it's in a gorgeous gated community of Hillcrest Estates in Laguna Niguel and you're literally minutes from Laguna Beach and Dana Point it's just a beautiful area today we have a, another listing appointment tomorrow we actually have another one as well so I have been just super busy, feeling really grateful and blessed that I can do this. Just like super busy at the moment. Things are picking up. It's a crazy time right now. Every time I talk to sellers, I just tell them that it's a crazy market and we have another home that's currently pending. So I'm uh, heading out right now. As you can see, I've got my full glam on. It's kind of like hazy and like cloudy outside like not really super sunny and I'm hoping that this weekend will be nice because I do want to get out I feel like I've been kind of cooped up in the house I've been getting like comments and questions on previous real estate vlogs about like door knocking and how like ha like how has door knocking actually impacted um, you know the listings that I've generated and and definitely I would highly recommend including door knocking into your weekly schedule. I know for me, it's hard to stay consistent because on the weeks that I do have appointments or I'm meeting with sellers, it's uh, it's challenging to kind of fit it in, but I would strongly suggest at least door knocking you know, a couple times a month because it really helps nurture your leads and build that relationship, establish that rapport with the people you're talking to. And more than anything, they can put a face to the person that's calling them, right? That's really important because it, it furthers along the, uh, you know, the, the trust, it kind of builds that connection and that relationship. So it's a really good strategy, I think. Um, and not just door knocking anybody and everybody, you wanna do like targeted door knocking. So anyone that you've talked to that you can consider a lead, I would say definitely go show face, give them some material. It really, really helps. My outfit today. Keeping it very comfortable. It's just like this long dress. Ah, finally having some coffee. Yesterday was a really good day of calling. It was pretty like remarkable how many people were answering the phone yesterday. And I was calling absentee owners, which by the way, if you aren't calling absentee owners, highly recommend calling. That's a really good lead source. Average pricing, so price per square foot, 641. The closest one to hers is Bermuda. Same, same in terms or, of- Sorry, uh, it's uh, Dutcher Avenue. Lot size is 5,600. That one sold for 970. So maybe She's expired what day what year? Oh, just recently. Okay, we're back. I'm in my office right now. I have to follow up with a few emails. It was a great meeting overall. I get really laser focused. I have so much attention during the conversation, during our meeting with these sellers that I feel like sometimes my head's just gonna explode because I'm just so laser focused on what's going on, the conversation, everything that we're saying because we are presenting a lot of information and I'm still learning the whole listing presentation. So I'm just kind of like taking it all in, but it just feels really 
nice to have a good successful meeting. We have another listing appointment in a couple days. So crossing fingers, that one goes well. Tomorrow is Friday, woohoo! This week has been flying by, I've been so busy. It's like I'm literally going a mile a minute. Wrapping up here in my office and then I'm gonna head downstairs stairs maybe go for a walk because it's nice and sunny out right now this morning actually it was like kind of cloudy but the sun's out now and uh, that was my day today this is Nassim with Berkshire Hathaway giving you a call we spoke about two weeks ago selling that property while the market is so high no it's an escrow how long how long is escrow yeah. is it 30 days well, it's supposed to close pretty quick, I don't know, in the next week, I think. Okay, gotcha. Well, that's exciting. It's a, it's a uh, leased property. It's a leased property, got it. Oh, it's been forwarded to an automatic voice training service from Google. And My name is please leave the name, I'm going to message. Otto in Rancho Santa Margarita, are you still the owner? Are you still the owner of the property on Via Honrado in Rancho Santa Margarita? Uh, yeah. Who are you? My name's Nassim. I'm with Berkshire Hathaway Realty. I'm a real estate agent in Orange County, and I'm calling because a home just sold in that neighborhood. And I was curious if you would consider selling that property while the market is so high. Yeah, no. I'm not interested right now. Thanks for the call. Of course. You have uh, tenants in there? What's that? You've got some uh, long-term tenants yeah, in thank there? thank you very much. Yeah, thank you very much. You're welcome. Have a wonderful weekend. I was curious if you would consider selling that property while the market is so high. It is. It is, yeah. Um, a home just sold in that neighborhood in two days for 25000 above asking. That's why I was wondering if you would consider selling the property because inventory is really yeah. tight. Yeah, I get it, but I just don't have any reason to really. I need, you know, the income works out great for, I'm retired and I play a lot of golf and it pays for my golf game. Oh, good, good. <laughs> All right, cool. So holding on to the property as an income property? Yeah, I have, I have quite a few rental properties. Yeah. And if you would consider selling that property while the market is so high? No, we're not going to sell it, but thank you for calling. You're welcome. Call has been forwarded to an automatic... I am at our new listing in Laguna Niguel in a beautiful guard-gated community of Hillcrest Estates. We have a photo shoot today and I'm excited to do the photo shoot and get the photos up on the internet and on all socials so that we can start marketing the property. I'm looking forward to getting this house sold. Strapped up the photo shoot of the property. We get photos tomorrow. I'm heading home right now. It's like 4 p.m. and gonna go home, change, take the dogs to the park, run them around a little bit, and then get dinner. Back at home and gonna open up the computer, check on a few things. Let's see here, what we got, what we got. Good morning guys, it is Saturday. I just woke up a couple hours ago and, <clears throat> whoa. Oh, hello. Just had my morning coffee and I'm sitting in front of my computer waiting for an email to come in so that I could send an email to a potential buyer for scheduling a showing and this potential buyer is a good lead because they may even be a seller. So I'm just sitting 
front of the computer right now and yeah, that is the morning so far. Oh, here we go. Got your email. All right, so I have Joe and Shelly. You want me to include both on that email? The email through Mojo, all right? And, and let them know that you're going to be working on scheduling him for a showing. Tell him please submit your pre-approval letter. Yesterday was crazy busy. Uh, I don't know how much I filmed of yesterday, but it was insane. I was dealing with scheduling showings for one of our listings, talking to buyers, and it was exciting but busy. So Saturday, I didn't really catch much of a break. I was uh, on call and doing lots of uh, scheduling. I was on the computer and all that good stuff. Today, however, is a good day. I do have a listening appointment, so I am all ready. I curled my hair. I'm just sitting on my computer. So wish me luck that it goes well. Tomorrow is gonna be a very busy day. I will be at one of our listings doing showings all day pretty much. I have another follow-up with one of our um, uh, appointments and hopefully they will sign and then uh, yeah that's that's pretty much my day today I'm gonna go to our appointment and that's uh, in a couple hours so I'm gonna head out here very shortly edit this vlog for you guys and have that up I hope you guys enjoyed these videos I hope you guys like these types of vlogs like this video don't forget to subscribe I will see you in my next one